What is up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be simulating what would happen if Mars hit Earth at the speed of light. Now I originally did a Mars and Earth collision at only a 10 kilometer a second velocity and today it's going to be quite a bit different. I am expecting even more impact and maybe even Earth to die out completely turning into a ring around the bloody sun. So let's get right into it, shall we? So first thing we want to do is change our velocity to a one light year. Yep, one light year. And we want to slow down our speed right down because the light year a second is very fast, guys. It's very fast. Nevertheless, just to make sure, I'll go down very. Oh my god, cool. So, it's actually moving quite fast per millisecond. So, this is only 10 milliseconds, and it just even under a minute it would impact Earth. I'm expecting complete destruction. Complete destruction to occur on both planets. Let's speed it up a bit. The collision course is on course. Mars is going to hit the Earth. How hard is it going to hit it? I have no idea. Is it going to kill the Earth completely? I'd say so. If it, if it doesn't, it'll launch Earth out of its orbit definitely with a light year speed. And I am sure that it would create a ring around the Sun. I am sure. I would also expect large earthquakes to occur even days before Mars hits Earth. It looks as if it's going to hit maybe Mexico. Yeah, Mexico. Maybe Central America. So let's lower it right down. So this is less than a second per second, guys. So we are going slower than real time. Ha ha ha. Ah, that pun gave me in real time. For only a few seconds though, we would see darkness. It would literally be a blank before we all die. Instantly, I expect when Mars hits the Earth, all of us to die. And we have impact. So as I expected, a big chunks of debris coming off straight away bigger than the moon two times bigger than the moon nearly three times bigger than the moon some maybe even larger two and a half the bl bloody hell so it looks as if the collision is stalled somehow like BAM it might be a light year but it just stalled completely it destroyed everything on the planet everything look at that I just everything's gone I expect since well okay so it seems like Mars now is continuing with the orbit with the earth this is quite interesting so it looks as if this is still minute this is still very slow guys but it looks as if the entire planet's getting impacted. It looks as if the Mars is making Earth spin faster. We can see that. I can see that. And it's just... Oh my god. Of course, is it getting launched out? Let's pause it for a second. Yep, it is definitely getting launched out. Yep, that's what I was looking for. And Earth, Earth's temperature is definitely unhittable, hittable. It's actually nearly the same. Look at all these impacts, impact craters from where the Earth is orbiting and Mars is hitting. Definitely huge. One of the biggest impacts in the universe, I'd say. And this is only a few minutes in, guys. Just imagine having a... Let's turn it right down to one second. 
very fast spin. Look at Mars, its temperature is getting right up there. Look at all that. Jeez, it's going to um vaporize by the looks of it. So it seems like it's slowing down. Right? Okay, so Mars is finally getting right into Earth. Definitely Earth would be altered and we are... Uh, how far are we out? Oh god, look at that. Nearly out to Jupiter already and it's only been less than an hour? 20 minutes. Really only 20 minutes. Twenty minutes and we're nearly out by Jupiter, and the impact hasn't even stopped yet. Okay, there's that. So we've got the finishing impact now. Look at it. Look at all those shock waves. That is amazing, guys. How far out are we? Whoa. So we're just passing a Jupiter's. We are past Jupiter's orbit. We are heading for Saturn's orbit. What's gonna happen? I don't know. Can the Earth survive somehow? Will it keep its orbit with the Sun? I doubt it. I actually doubt it. I feel like the only one... Whoa! So I've actually nearly lost the Earth completely. Um, so it looks as if these fragments are bloody bang. They are 10,000 degrees, guys. 10,000 degree fragments. As big as the moon hotter than the Sun okay guys let's see what happens over time we already know what's gonna happen it's gonna launch out how fast is it gonna take for the temperature go to go down how long is it gonna take guys well we're going days per second and it's going down thousands thousands per month probably a few years I'd say up to 20 years Nope, even more. Maybe a few hundred years. Yeah, I'd say a few hundred years, maybe even thousands. Thousands, guys. I just really want to follow this. Where is Earth right now? Are we in the dark abyss yet? Yep, we are in the dark abyss. We are definitely out of our solar system. Let's see what happens if we just change the temperature to zero. So look at that. No way that that would be like that. No way would we have as much sun as we did back then. It would be nearly dark, completely dark with just... Maybe if just the sun would look like another star to us. It's so small. I wouldn't. We wouldn't get heat. In fact, we'd probably go right down to the minuses right down the only way that earth could survive this is enough volcanic eruptions to keep the earth warm if you know what i mean i mean look at the vol look at the rotation in the milliseconds it's it's very fast unbearable what happens if we make a another collision only one kilometer one kilometer a second very slow i barely think it's gonna hit it because the earth is just traveling so quick well since we've reached the end of the universe maybe it will okay that is interesting so, yeah, it did have an effect. The Earth is back into the thousands. Let's switch it back down to 16. Um, complete destruction, obviously. And look, we bugged out the game completely. Look, it looks as if there's a shadow rotating the planet. Again, we wouldn't have enough light. Well, this light would be enough. So guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching. Remember to subscribe for more content. Twitter and Instagram links are in the description. I enjoyed this video. 
Remember to leave a like on this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.